it's a beautiful Sunday, and we're gonna head out for some pokey. Your blogger voice is so cute. Just, this is not my blogger voice, this is my normal voice. Is your normal excited voice? Yes, my normal voice. excited cute Yay. voice. Yay! <laughs> You know, very, very cameraman mode today. I don't know. No, no. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> On program or something like that. Yeah. Um, I was assuming those were his pro. That he meant the program. Ooh. You don't mind. You don't mind being on camera, right? So I'm currently a master's student at the Royal College of Music and I study classical piano performance which means I just basically practice all day every day um, just to make myself a better pianist and make myself a better performer so I can share music um, on a technical and artistic level. So I'm just really super excited about this performance we're about to do in a few hours and yeah, can't wait to get that filmed and share with you guys.
soloist of the afternoon looking really really damn hot yeah and Oh, and makeup. Oh, fuck, I have glitter all over my Oh, I did my makeup. Oh, nice. Yeah. So I, like, I thought I could do my makeup this morning. So this is my performance makeup. Very simple, so I don't sweat off everything. When we go on stage and we put on our makeup, it's definitely like comfort number one priority. Mm -hmm. Because this one time, I remember, I tried to put false lashes on when I like white right when I was about to go perform oh, and then yeah oh my gosh it's like I feel like I can't lift my eyelids and you know as a as a classical musician when we perform we're like super hyper focused so we cannot afford to have any distractions and that includes false lashes so sorry you get your he's, he's ready to yeah. share whenever okay cool I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. Mess. <laughs> You're such a basic bitch. I'm sorry. So how do you feel? I feel really oh, yeah. good. I had I had some little slips, but I don't think they were very dramatic. So no, I think it's very good. Okay. I think it's very expensive. Yeah. Oh my god, I'm really yeah. tired. Yeah, yeah, I mean, dude. I'm like, and my my bra kept like. It's like <laughs> you sure you want to say that on camera? And I'm like, I totally did it. Describe your day again. Uh, okay. It's 8 a.m. I'm at my desk. Hey, it's 10 a.m. I'm at my desk. Hey, it's 12. I just had a hand shandy. I'm still at my desk. <laughs> I didn't manage to get too much footage yesterday and also the day before. In the spirit of keeping this vlog as real as possible and really showing you guys what it's like to be in the week of a life of a classical musician, you know, what we experience on a day-to-day -day in like week-to-week -week basis is that we have all these up and downs that come and go really, really quickly. And yesterday, I had no idea that I would feel so down that it would literally be impossible for me to pick up the camera and film. So like really big props to all the YouTubers out there who are doing creative things, who also go through these emotional roller coasters and are able to stay consistent and like bam, 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 like film every single day. But basically yesterday I was a bit of an emotional wreck. So I thought, you know, for the sake of the first video, I wouldn't, wouldn't really upload that stuff. I guess I've also never talked about why exactly I'm starting to vlog right now. In this modern society, like classical music is not really something that people can easily get into. And unlike the mass produced popular music we get nowadays, classical music is not really written to capture your attention. So it definitely doesn't make itself easy to be appreciated. So I think the whole point of me trying to make this YouTube channel is just to show a different side 
of classical musicians and what classical musicians do. It is really easy to get into this art. It's an amazing art form. It has so much to offer. I think everyone can get something out of it and everyone, like whatever they get out of it, it's going to be different because it's such a subjective experience. And I think that's really the beauty of it. So I think this is what my channel is going to be about, really promoting classical music and really promoting fine arts in general. exhausted and I just can't wait to fall asleep in my own bed because I'm so tired. Gosh. Before I go home, can we just please appreciate how beautiful the Royal Albert Hall looks at night? Uh, maybe I should practice more at night. I never get sick of this view.